Well, new at five, a 75 year old Savannah woman is rebuilding after she says someone crashed a car into her home and then drove off. This happened earlier this month on Love Street, leaving the woman without running water in her home. Flynn Snyder spoke with her today as the search for the driver continues. Juanita Washington's backyard is taken up by a portable toilet. Distressing for me. She's forced to use this after she says a person crashed a car into the side of her house and fled the scene, damaging a pipe and leaving the home without running water. And my bathroom is located right there. And I saw all the water flowing all over everywhere. Washington wasn't home at the time, but a Savannah police report says officers responded to the Love Street house around midday on May 3rd. When they got there, officers noticed a damaged corner of the house with a ruptured water line. Orange debris from a vehicle hood was near the damaged corner. Police later determined the fleeing vehicle was an orange 2005 Pontiac. It's been real rough. Ever since the crash, Washington says she's had to spend nearly $160 for the portable toilet and by gallon jugs of water. I see coming up Mother's Day. I said, I just felt so bad Mother's Day. I said, this is coming up Mother's Day. And it's just, don't have any of these, you know, the use of anything. Neighbors have stepped up to help Washington buy water from the store. It's due to no fault of our own. Um, and whomever did it, rather than them staying at the scene and, you know, giving, you know, acknowledging what they did and holding themselves accountable, they, fled and left her home in disarray. Even though police haven't officially determined the cause of the crash, Washington hopes this serves as a reminder for drivers in the neighborhood to slow down. All this speeding up and down the street of Eagle Street, they're just flying up and down the street. Now, as the 75 year old stands among the tire marks in her yard, she's hoping police find the driver responsible and that the water line will soon be fixed. In Savannah, Flint Snyder, WTOC News. We have some breaking news to give you an update.